Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. So I've spent so long trying to find the perfect filming setup. This is the best I can come up with. It's not great, but I feel like we're just going to have to go with it for now until, until, until things are sorted, which is going to be a while, but actually it's not that bad. I was just a bit worried about the lighting because it is quite a dark room. I'm in my bedroom and there's not much natural light, but I feel like it's okay, especially for a haul. I'm gonna be showing you guys some of my favorite pieces for autumn, winter. So we have, I'm gonna to have to look around the room. We have H&M, Zara, New Look, ASOS, Matalan, um, and other stories, and a bit of Lululemon as well. A variety of different shops, and as always, everything will be linked below. Let's get started. Let's start on H&M. And let's pay some attention to the gorgeous shacket that I've got on. So, shackets are everywhere. They, when did like the whole shacket thing start? I feel like it started a few years ago and um, it's just exploded. I love it. I think they're so easy to style. They're so practical. They're so comfortable. And Jordan actually chose this shacket from H&M and it's so nice i love the colors i really love the contrast of the it's kind of like a dark gray i guess i was gonna say black but it's not a dark gray and the cream of course the cream and the neutrals are everywhere but i also love to add a bit of contrast to that i don't love everything to be cream although i do love cream but i feel like adding a bit of contrast just makes it look better really so yeah love this jacket i'm gonna turn the camera so you can see it like styled. I'm sort of right against the wall. This is like the furthest back I can go. But yeah, this is how I've styled it. I've styled it over a jumper dress. This jumper dress is top shop and it is over two years old because I wore it when I was pregnant with the twins. I love it, like it's so nice and um, it just goes perfectly with shackets, but I will link a similar jumper dress below. But yeah, I've styled the shacket with the jumper dress and the most dreamy boots from ASOS. So I know we're not on ASOS at the moment, but I felt like these boots deserved a moment of their own. These sell out so quickly. So if they are sold out, I will link some similar below, but what a gorgeous outfit. It's been too warm to wear anything like this and it is actually too warm today, but the weather is changing. I can feel it in the air. But I can't wait to wear an outfit like this. I think it's so lovely. And yeah, these boots definitely deserved a moment of their own. So keeping within the jumper dress theme, I have this one from H&M. So as you can see, it's a cream with black contrast stitching. It's really comfortable. Obviously, it's a jumper dress. I feel like all jumper dresses are comfortable. And let me move the camera down. So you can see length and stuff like that. So it's a really lovely length. Here it is from the back. But yeah, a cute jumper dress. I have styled it with Doc Martens. So I got these the other day. Excuse a dodgy carpet setup. If anyone's new here, we're currently living in a renovation project. Um, yeah, I got these the other day and how nice are they? They are just standard Doc Martens but they have like um a really soft feel so I will link the exact ones below because I know there are actually quite a few and it can get quite confusing but there they are there and so many people say you need to size up um they take ages to break in these are so comfortable okay when I first put them on my feet they were maybe slightly tight around that area but it literally went within within an hour, like they just felt normal and really comfortable. I didn't size up at all, I went for my normal size. So for some people they might be uncomfortable, but for me, honestly, they they just feel really comfortable. So yeah, there we go, here's my new Doc Martens. So this jumper is another one of Jordan's picks when we went to H&M the other day. He spotted it straight away and told me this was the in color. He's right, obviously, because it is the in color, it's everywhere. Um, I've seen blazers in it, trousers in it, shorts in it. It's also a great colour to kind of freshen up your autumn winter wardrobe. 
when it comes to autumn winter i think it's so easy to just kind of stick to black grays and creams which i have a lot of and i do love but i love to add a bit of color and kind of freshen it up a bit um make it a bit fun so that's what this jumper is i love the whole kind of feel of it and how easy it is to wear you can just throw it on and um, pair it with a pair of jeans or a pair of leggings and you have a really easy to wear cute outfit so I've paired it with these jeans which I'm going to show you which are also from H&M so I saw these jeans on my friend Gillian and they looked so good I thought I had to purchase them so here they are they have obviously rips in the knees and they are flared so flared and baggy jeans are officially the jean to wear this autumn winter what do you guys think of baggy and flared jeans i personally really like them i feel like a bit of my teenage years are coming back i never thought they'd be back but you know how wrong was i they are back i'm loving h&m for jeans they have such a lovely selection and they're a really good price too so I picked up this grey hoodie because a grey mile hoodie is an absolute essential all year round. I was going to say for autumn, winter, but I think this year has shown me that hoodies are essential all year round, along with shirts, because, yeah, um, the weather wasn't great this year, was it? So, uh, yeah, they're an essential all year round. So I got this one and I love the way that you can really elevate a hoodie with a really lovely coat so i have got a coat from zara i'm going to show you and i'll show you what i mean by kind of elevating loungewear and elevating hoodies with a coat and with a hat and things like that and with some boots but um it's so comfortable as well so yeah this great mile hoodie accessorizing so me and jordan both went to h&m and i can't remember who got what hat but i thought i'd show you the hats we got first up this one just a cute cream beanie with with some stitching on the front. I then chose this one because I thought it was really cool. And I wasn't sure if it's going to be like silly oversized, but I actually really think it's a good oversized and I can really imagine myself wearing it with the right outfit. This maybe isn't the right outfit, but um, I love it. And I love that whole MTV vibe. Those colours are my kind of colours. I then got that one, which is again, my kind of color, kind of like a rust oh, brown. Do you want to say brown? Like a, like a really dark, dusky, pinky brown. But yeah, really love that color. And then of course, a gray beanie, but I really like the stitching on the front. Um, yeah, that's the beanies I got from H&M. I got a black hoodie as well from H&M. H&M is so good for those kind of basic items. Everyone needs a black hoodie in their life. And I actually didn't have one. I had one ages ago, but it went a bit funny. And um, I haven't had one since. So here's a black hoodie. And yeah, really love it. And I'm actually gonna show you what I mean by elevating it quickly. So this coat is from Zara and paired with a hoodie, I think it gives such a lovely, smart, casual look. So hoodies can look obviously really casual, but if you pair it with a coat like this, it can really take your kind of outfit to the next level. Now I'd probably actually prefer if I had on matching jogging bottoms, just because it gives a really lovely contrasting look, but that's what I mean about elevating a hoodie. So you could wear a tracksuit or a hoodie, and if you pair it with a coat like this, which was 30 pounds from Zara, it just gives the outfit a whole different look and feel. So next I have this really beautiful cardigan. I feel like you guys will really love this cardigan because I had one very similar last year. I've still got it obviously um, in cream. It was a bit more like voluminous than this one, but I got so many questions about it. So I feel like you're gonna love this one. It's really easy to wear, really comfortable, and looks lovely paired with a pair of jeans, which I have on now. So a really lovely casual cardigan. Obviously I have it done up and I'm wearing it just on its own, but you can wear it undone with like a bodysuit underneath. But yeah, absolutely love this cardigan. I love it when you find like a really good find like this that you know is gonna live in your wardrobe for a long time because it is timeless. It's kind of trendless, like cardigans are cardigans and 
they're always in. So yeah, love this. And when I sit up on my tiptoes to try and show you the jean look, I'm gonna fall over, so um, yeah. So next, a different kind of cardigan style. This is a really comfortable zip up, a grey mull. I would probably wear this with joggers, obviously I've still got the jeans on, but I think it would look better with joggers, but just a really comfy kind of grey oversized zip up. So it does have a pull in here, but you don't have to have that, you can have it like that if you wish, but yeah, really cute and really comfy. Anything that's comfortable and um, easy to wear lives in my wardrobe. <laughs> so last, but by no means least, because this is a gorgeous piece from H&M, is this jumper. Now, if you shop on H&M a lot, you'll probably recognize this style because they've done it the last few years and I have it in a few different colors. And I had to get it in this really lovely light cream color because I haven't got it in this color. So I know I get a lot of wear out of this style because obviously I've got it in different colors and it's just lovely. And they did have it in a few different colors in store, probably more online, but I'll have a look when I'm um, editing this video. But yeah, I know I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of it. It's comfortable, it's easy to wear. So I've paired it here with the H&M jeans, but you could pair it with joggers, leggings as well. It's not the longest, but um, would still look all right with leggings if you wanted it to, obviously. But yeah, this lovely cozy jumper. So next up we have Zara. So everything is kind of like loungewear, casual from Zara, which I picked up. Obviously, obviously there's other stuff in there too, but that's just what I picked up. So. First of all, we have this black loungewear set, which is a jumper. I also picked up this bag, which I really like. So it's quilted and then it has a slogan strap. So it's cream with black detailing. So it'll go with a lot of my autumn winter wardrobe, which is why I loved it. And then here are the black joggers. So the jumper is cropped. Um, yeah, I am gonna say it's cropped because it's, it's really not that long at all. It's not like mega crop, but it is cropped. And then here are the joggers. So I would say if you're after a pair of joggers and you like the look of these Zara ones, then size up because um, these are a medium. They're actually quite tight. So yeah, I'd probably size up, but a cute loungewear set nonetheless. So next I have an outfit which looked way better in my imagination then I feel like it does on, but I don't know. I feel like I might grow with it um, and warm to it, but I don't know. I feel like maybe with a cardigan, it'll look, probably look better. My hair is everywhere. I'll just put this roll neck on. So it's a roll neck and wide leg jogging bottoms from Zara. So I feel like Zara's sizing is slightly all over the place. So this is a medium, whereas the previous tracksuit was slightly snug and um, these medium fit me fine so that's great uh, the top is ribbed and i feel like i would love to pair this outfit with a pair of chunky white trainers and a cardigan as i said or like a oversized black hoodie like the one i got from h&m i feel like that would look really nice maybe even the coat i got from zara but let me know what you guys think because i'm not a hundred percent sure on it so last but not least from zara i want to show you this off-white, I was gonna call it cream, but I feel like it's more off-white. Puffer coat, I love Zara coats. I still remember a Zara coat I got years ago and it lasted me like year after year. So I love Zara for coats and this one is so lovely. So um, yeah, it is off-white and it has gold kind of detailing. It's really warm and it is perfect for this season. So next up we have new look and I have four shirts to show you. Now, I am obsessed with shirts at the moment. They're so easy to wear and they last all year round as I figured out this year. They're not just a seasonal thing. I used to think they were just for autumn, winter, but no, they are all year round and they can be styled up in so many different ways. So my favorite way to style them is actually like over a bodysuit or, um, or a t-shirt or something like that, but you can also style them with jeans. So I have on a pair of jeans at the moment, the ones from H&M, and I love the way you can style shirts 
like so there are so many different ways and of course the easiest way to wear shirts are over leggings so a pair of black leggings an oversized shirt and you are away so i have four to show you from new look this is the first one so a black checked shirt i've rolled the sleeves back but yeah you can literally wear this so many different ways so this next shirt i feel like i can get so much more wear out of it in spring summer because it is actually quite spring summer when you try it on and i love it um tied up with a pair of jeans like the jeans i've got on i think it looks so nice and i love the contrast i saw it on instagram and thought it looked lovely you can also wear shirts over swimwear as well when you're on holiday which i think is such a cool look but yeah this is definitely more spring at summer but i still love it and thought i'd thought i'd show you it Okay, so the last two shirts are very similar and I did size up because I think you kind of have to, but it's this pink one and then this pink large checked one. So very similar, but I think these two shirts are just perfect for those kind of like everyday days. I think sometimes it's hard when you see clothes to actually envisage what they're gonna look like and where you're gonna wear them every day but this is just a perfect everyday outfit so i paired the shirt with black leggings and i think a pair of white trainers and it's just a simple awesome winter everyday outfit do you know where i can really see me wearing this soft play like it's a perfect soft play outfit for autumn winter and yeah i um i'll be spending some time at soft play over the next few months that's for sure but yeah this is a perfect outfit for that and if you have young children you need these kind of easy to wear comfortable go-to outfits in your wardrobe next up something a bit different from a haul but lululemon now lululemon is higher end high street but i discovered them last year so it's the first piece i got from them last year and this was it so these these leggings and from these leggings i have completely fallen in love with the brand they are a premium price point but they last so for that there's that and if you can wear them year after year it's it's worth the investment i think and number two they are so nice they feel amazing like honestly they feel absolutely amazing i find them really flattering i'm talking about the leggings but the brand overall um they're just such a lovely brand and i've completely fallen in love with every single piece that they do i don't have many but i'm kind of like building up my lululemon collection because i just adore everything that they do so these leggings i got last year still in absolutely perfect condition i wear them a lot i wash them a lot perfect condition so they have recently opened a shop in bath which i'm not sure if it's a good thing or a bad thing but um i went in the other day and just fell in love with with every single thing in there and if you do have a shop near you and you're walking past Go in, feel the material, try some stuff on and you will know exactly what I mean. It's completely next level and I just love it. So I have on this jumper, this black jumper and then the black pair of Lululemon leggings. Now it's a really simple outfit, but it's a timeless outfit and it's an everyday outfit you can wear every day. So yeah, absolutely adore this outfit, adore Lululemon. If you've never been in there, then go in and really get a feel for the pieces and I think you might just fall in love. They also have a section on their website as well, which is called We Made Too Much. And you can go on there and you can get pieces that are Lululemon, but they're a much cheaper price point. So that's also a good place to look if you do want some Lululemon pieces. So next up we have ASOS. Now I got some really, really beautiful jumpers from ASOS. ASOS is just a favourite of mine. It's been a favourite of mine for years. And um, I'm going to pair all of the jumpers. Well, no, actually not all of them. Most of them with my Lululemon black leggings. But yeah, this mint jumper. Now there's a brand on ASOS called Reclaimed Vintage. And I just love every one of their pieces. So um, 
these jumpers are from the brand Reclaimed Vintage, but this one is just so lovely. I love the colour, I love how easy it is to throw on with leggings. You can wear it with jeans, you can wear it with whatever you like, but yeah, just absolutely love it. It's got a raw edge at the bottom, and um, yeah, a really cute ASOS jumper for autumn winter. So then got this Santorini jumper, which is somewhere that I really want to go, love to go to Santorini. But I loved the pink and the cream contrast, so it was really cute. And just one to throw on with a pair of leggings or a pair of jeans for an everyday easy look. It fits really lovely. It's actually quite a thin material, so one um, that you won't get too hot in because there's nothing worse when you put on a big jumper and like you want to clean or something like that and you get really hot. Like <laughs> Those jumpers are needed at times, like if you're going out and about, but if you're just at home or at soft play with the children, then this is a great jumper for that. So another reclaimed vintage jumper. This one I got like super oversized because they're also unisex. So Jordan can wear them too. So that's a double win because he would totally wear this and it's really lovely. But yeah, they are unisex. So this one I got larger than the next one I'm gonna show you. So this is a medium and it is a big oversized fit but sometimes there's nothing you want more than just a really big baggy oversized jumper and a pair of leggings and trainers and it's just such a simple and easy to wear outfit for autumn winter but absolutely love the colour of this jumper love the whole vintage feel as it is the brand reclaimed vintage and yeah another cute jumper but I feel like I've got my favourite to show you next how cute is this rust tracksuit? So I have actually worn this jumper on its own as well and I love both on their own but I just adore them together. I think it looks so lovely, such an easy to wear. Dress up, and when I say dress up, I mean like elevate, not like, you know, dressy. Um, or dress down, tracksuit, so perfect for around the house or you could also put a really lovely coat on a nice pair of trainers, socks, bag, and wear it shopping or something like that. So completely adore this tracksuit. And not only do I love it, it's also unisex. So like the previous reclaimed vintage jumper, it's unisex, so Jordan can wear this tracksuit as well. So it's just like a win-win because I know he'll love it. So if I'm not wearing it, he can wear it. Let me know what you think of unisex clothing. Would you and your partner share clothes it's not something we've ever done before i've definitely stolen his jumpers before but it's not something i've kind of like set out to do like buy unisex clothing but i feel like it's a really good idea and would totally do it so let me know what you think can we just take a moment to appreciate this shacket from matalan i am just obsessed with it it is so nice and it feels so premium not only that it's really thick as well so it's really warm so it would double up as a coat like you could totally wear this in the next few months and be be absolutely fine um i love it so much it's so nice it's that really lovely borg material love the color and i love it with this gray jumper dress which is a few years old from H&M but I will link a similar one below and I've paired it with these light brown boots from ASOS which are just dreamy but yeah well done Matalan because this is a dream. So I just wanted to show you this oversized blazer from and other stories I think that's what it's called or other stories or stories um there's a shop in Bristol and I've actually never been in it, but I really want to go in it because I love the brand and I love the pieces. But I actually got this last year. So I've never worn it properly. I've tried it on and stuff, but I've never kind of worn it anywhere because when I got it, I think everything was just a bit up in the air with going places and things like that. But um, it's going to be so handy for this year. It's so lovely. It's still on the website now, so I thought I'd show you it. And um, it looks great over jumper dresses. It kind of formalizes an outfit, but again, it's really simple and easy to wear and it's relaxed. So you could also wear it casually as well. Just sort of show you because I think it's really cute, but 
Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoy this autumn winter haul video and I'll see you soon.